Good morning, my students, and welcome to your English class. Now, today, we are going to have a review of all the letters that we have seen so far. Remember that you are copying words, so those words, we are going to remember them today. But before that, let's see if you remember also two things that we have previously seen. The watch and the clock. Do you remember what is watch? Watch is the object that you put in your hand so you can check the time, okay? And the clock, it's the same object, but it's bigger, and it goes here on the wall, okay? Excellent. And remember, the question to check the hour is, what time is it? ¿Qué hora es? You check your watch and you say, five o'clock, six o'clock, seven o'clock depending on the time, okay? Don't forget that. So, like I mentioned it, let's concentrate on all the words that appear in the past. Let's put them here on the whiteboard and let's start. The first word is beer. Now, do you remember what is a beer? It's a fruit, color green, very small fruit that you can eat it. <sighs> mm, very pure, so very delicious, okay? Very good. Now, beer begins with the letter P, the letter of Pedro, of Pablo, okay? Don't forget that. Let's continue with the pet. Now, here in the pet, I don't have a drawing because there are several pets. Remember, the pet, it's an animal that lives in our house. Pets are like dogs, cats, mouse, another pet, a turtle can be also a pet, okay? Those are mascotas, animals that live in our house. For example, a horse, horse, remember, horse. Is horse a pet? No, because horse is too big. He belongs to another place, not in our house. Another one, mm, a sheep, a sheep, does a sheep belong to a house? Can we have a sheep in our house? No, because sheep are animals for the farm, para una granja, not for the house. So that is why it's, that, that's why it's not a pet, okay? Pets, only animals that live with us. Very good. Now, let's continue. Ah, something also very important about the word pet. Begins with the letter P of Peter, of Pablo, of Peer. Another object, it's the plate. Now, plate, it's an object where you can put food, comida, hamburgers, pizza, all type of food, you can put it in a plate. But you have to be careful because plates are very sensible. If you drop it, it can broke okay so you have to be careful with plates now plates have different colors in this case i put it color blue now pet the plate it's it be, sorry begins with letter p of beer and pet okay the plate let's continue with the piano now piano it's a musical instrument that is big well pianos have different sizes but the most commons are very big, okay? And piano is a, not a musical instrument, so you can play music, beautiful music, okay? Very good. Now, piano is also a word that begins with the letter B. Now, let's continue with the next object. It's called a picture. Now, a picture is an object like a rectangle that contains images, okay? In this case, the image that appears here, it's a desert, un desierto. But there are also all types of images. So those images appear in this rectangle that is called picture, and you can hang them on the walls, okay? Very good. Now, picture starts with the letter B. All of these words that appear here, the beer, the bed, the plate, the piano and the picture, all of them begin with the letter P of Pablo, okay? Very good. And let's continue with the second page. 
Now, for the second page, we have more objects that we have seen before. The apple, that's very common, and that's a very easy word. We have the apple. Now, don't forget that apple is a fruit. Mmm, <sighs> very good, very delicious, the apple. Now, apples are color red, and sometimes you can find apples that are color yellow and green, but the most common are reds, okay? Let's continue with the other word, which is a cat. Now, cat, it's a pet, because it's an animal that we can have in our house. Now, the teacher, I like cats, okay? Now, the cats are mostly very small, very tiny, like this size, okay? Cats are very small. And do you remember what is the sound of these animals? That's right. Meow, meow. That's the sound of the cats, okay? And in this case, my cat, I painted color white with the ears color pink. Let's continue with another animal. The animal that appears here is the dog. Now, dog is also a pet because lives with us, okay? Now, pets have different sizes. Some of them are big, very big, or some of them are very small, okay? In this case, the, pet, the, the dog that appears here, it's colored brown, okay? Let's continue with the other word. Now here, I don't have the drawing because the word is very easy, facile. The word is doctor. Now a doctor, it's a person that cures people. When a person is sick, <coughs> oh, my stomach, oh, my back, okay? We go to a doctor and the doctor give us medicine so we can feel better, so we can feel stronger, okay? Very good, that's a doctor. Now, the next object, it's a doll. Now, the dolls are part of toys. It's a group of the toys, de los juguetes, okay? So, doll is mostly for girls. Remember, the teacher is a boy, the girl, la niña, okay? It's more for girls, the dolls. Now, the final object is a door. Now, doors are like a big rectangle that covers parts of the house. Now, if you want to enter another room, you have to open a door, you have to open it so you can enter another room or a house, okay? So these are doors. Now, all of these letters, with the exception of apple and cat, begin with the letter D, the D of Diego, which is doctor, dog, door, and doll. Now, don't forget the correct pronunciation of these objects because this sounds similar, but they finish very different. Dog. Doll. With L at the end. Doll. And the last one. Dor. With R at the end. Dor. Okay? Don't forget to make those adjustments when you pronounce these words. Now, before we finish the class, my children, let's review one more time the object. Let's pronounce it correctly. And that's it. Very good. Let's see. Beer. Bed. Plate. Piano. Picture. Apple. Cat. Doctor. Dog. Doll and door. Excellent, excellent pronunciation, my children. Now, also, don't forget to do excellent work in your activities. Remember that you have to copy word by word, letter by letter. Some letters, they need one squares, one square. Two letters require two squares. Don't forget to leave spaces, the cut espacios, and also Remember, the teacher doesn't work with cursive letters, so you work with normal letters, okay? The, the previous uh, word, you copy it again, no cursive letter, only normal letter, okay? And just one time, un solo regular, okay? 
So that's it for today, my children. We we'll see you tomorrow. Have an excellent day and goodbye.